Hi everyone, this update about Bitcoin. Bitcoin is still struggling one of my particular area, you guys can see. And right now I'm going to talk about first uh, how the Bitcoin can drop drastically one of my particular target area and my expectation area. So still not yet subscribe the channel, subscribe the channel, press the like button, leave a comment guys. That's how we motivating me and help me to achieve 2000 subscribers level. So right now you guys can see the price is moving pretty much sideways to the target area target area is this trend line we need to break the trend line and retest to move higher and right now two scenario is possible so we will first of all i keep the, my moves here because i'm expecting to drop here in case of we did not see the dropped in here till the 15 of september 15 and uh, yeah sorry 15 of x uh, september we did not see any uh, drop so the scenario is going to be like that we drop drastically as of wave one pretty much move higher price my expectation at least uh, Bitcoin will hit uh, this level 20,451 level after that my in case of fake out fake out will be again 17,500 again you guys can see the trying area 18,000 maybe we go a little more lower prices an expectation area is going to be the 18,881 and after that we seeing the lower prices again below than the 16 uh, thou, uh, below than the 15,500 and uh, almost 12,000 above the target area is going to be here so that's my expectation in case of we fake out from the trend line keep it in your mind and that's how it is the price move so at the moment we are pretty much holding that the scenario and if i zoom out you guys can see pretty much bitcoin following one scenario like this the one trend line always and we are trying to go below and pretty much regaining and almost trying to make high low but is the high low only only one even we did not go below than the previous low that is one of the best scenario at the moment and i need to show you very important thing because bitcoin trying to defend the previous swing high price that's what i marked down here 19803 and then 19547 this area is the 2017 uh, Bitcoin swing at uh, the new all time high in 2017. So I will give you that update also. I need the daily chart. So in here pretty much. So the right now I marked down the peaked area, the both peaked in a green color, you guys can see here, the green color and the red color end. Right now I marked down these two areas with uh, the prices because I feel Bitcoin trying to defend these two areas with the when we drop in a 19,500 uh, 19, level, we get immediately recovered. And when we drop 19,800 levels, we get immediate recovered. That is the scenario. And in line with it, the, my last drop is 19,337. That's already a little bit above because I don't want to change this one. This is the one of significant level. Anyway, uh, everyone know now where that two price target came. Always when I configure something, when I add any support resistant trend line, there is reason for that support and resistance that's what i need to show you because right now when i come back to the what happened last few days so you guys can see pretty much uh, bitcoin trying to defend that particular area these are the price target yellow line and we are trying to defend that areas so that is the best of best scenario for bitcoin at the moment so till the time we are holding that level and the next scenario, how I can consider Bitcoin is bullish. 
so everyone remember i talk about the falling wedge pattern right now we're seeing the exit from the falling wedge pattern so pretty much we make the three times low and after that we exit from we seeing the exit from the falling wedge pattern and retest that trend uh, falling wedge pattern upper level exactly we did not go below than that we touched that level and after that we started to move higher and first we touch this level and get the bounce from there but that not stronger enough that's what i personally believe because we the next candle and we started to move little more higher prices and previously what happened we touched the previous higher prices like 20,445 after that you seeing we touch the lower levels to confirm we already out of the uh, wedge pattern so right now where the price going to be the everyone know the falling wedge pattern is super bullish we need to move a little bit higher and before then that we have 786 FIP level so that FIP level going to be the, the resistance that's why the price is dropped and the next scenario is this one 50 period moving average so we're trying to move higher than the 50 period moving average the 50 period moving average is going to be the overhead resistance everyone knows you know 50 period moving average is the very strong uh, simple moving average when we seeing that touch and we did not we in case of we go below than that time everyone started to uh, the sell it because of their get they know this is going to be the downside the what do you call margin trading the short trading they will start at. that's what we seeing this huge candle to down so that's what i need to show you and previously we touched the previous high levels that's why we dropped that 618 FIP level so we seeing the downside potential this one again uh, we touched the 50 period moving average we down again and it's still trying to defend that the two price target area i will name in between this is the 2017 uh new all time high <laughs> and it's still trying to defend that's all about the bitcoin if you love the content subscribe the channel press the like button leave a comment guys that's how we motivating me and help you to achieve 2000 subscribers level thank you very much have a lovely day be safe